Hey everybody! Um, today I'm going to pour for the first time on Upo paper. And uh, as you can see, I taped it to a priority mail bo ma uh, envelope, box, whatever they're called. But I do ship all my stuff through USPS. So, so I do use them. I'm not just painting on it. <laughs> but that's... So Joyce, who sent me the Naples yellow and other colors, she sent me some Yupo paper to use. She's a, a watercolorist, and I have been wanting to try Yupo, but I just never had. So she sent me some, and I'm just going to do a good old-fashioned um, uh, flip cup on this, because then what I want to do is cut it um and back them on colored cardstock and make cards out of them so it won't be i don't think it will be a flip and drag or anything like that um i don't even have a cup near me let me grab that totally unprepared for this <laughs> All right. So I'm using a uh, Grumbacher turquoise green and Liquitex Basic Bright Aqua and Thalo Blue, which has silicone. Wait, are these really the colors I chose? No. Why would I have chosen these? I must have. But that's not what I want to do. Okay, so put that back. Um, and uh, I so love orange, but it just never looks good anymore. Oh, I'll use ah, I'll use Liquitex light blue violet. I really don't know how I ended up with all of those turquoise colors. I must not have been paying attention <laughs> to myself. So I'm going to stir this up. All the paints are mixed with Floetrol and water. You can check, um, search my name, you'll find a couple videos on paint mixing. Um, and as I said, this is the only one with silicone. I've got my spot on treadmill silicone. And this plastic thing I'm painting in is a washing machine pan. And these bars are just metal shelving bars. Um, just like $3 metal shelving bars. Uh, I was gonna add some white to this, but I don't think I will. Well, no, I don't think I will. But I may change my mind. Let me put a little drop in at the very end. Oh no! Nah, I don't think I will. Because I think I have plenty right here. Actually, I think I will scoop up, I'm going to scoop up ugh, a bit of the white onto this, and that's what I'm going to use to stir. Good old fashioned flip cup. Hopefully there's enough in here. It's been a while since I've done one of these. With no white or anything. Not very bright. I was hoping for a little bit brighter. Ok, 
है just occurred to me that maybe I should have taped up the side so that the paint doesn't get underneath and stick. As I said, I'm not using this USPS box in blasphemy. That's who I ship my art through. <laughs> I feel like I keep needing to defend myself as I realized I'm on like public using these, but. Hmm, I am going to need more paint than I thought. I'm adding some more pink and teal white. I'm going to shake that puppy up. Hmm. I like the way it looks. I mean, it will be cut up, so it won't be, you know, I won't be viewing this as a whole. But yet, not all of it is super interesting. <laughs> For some reason, watching my paint move on here is making me think of Jabba the <laughs> which is not a very flattering sentiment, but, and I really don't know why it is, but it's the first thing that came to my mind. I'm really interested to see how this Upo paper, um, will dry. I mean, it would be a lot easier making cards this well, not easier, but then dipping, but um, it, it, I guess it's a totally different look. boring. I can do that since I will be cutting it up. Obviously it would look really weird if I just had one corner of a painting. 
swiped. But since I'm cutting it, it will be all right. But now I'm thinking the rest of the paint might be a little thick. Yeah. So I might be going over that anyways. Now's when I just start playing. Except I don't like that. It's going to be way too thick though to dry. My Yupo paper will just get demolished. Don't know why I added all that other. I really didn't need to. So now I'm going to drip all this off this way and then tilt it back the other way. goal was to have less on there scrape that off so that I'm not just till <laughs> so I'm not just uh, pouring it right back on now I'm just evening out the pattern getting more of the dark blue over there because I don't like what's there right now So this isn't a very pretty um, experiment. <laughs> so far. Okay, so now I'm just going to, I just don't want it to come back. It. 
so I think I'm going to pull it up I can basically I want to see what it feels like This is probably what I should have been doing. You love, you learn. Kind of cool if I just let it kind of do its thing. This is fun. I mean, it's pretty much like kind of like photo paper. <laughs> oh, this is cool. I think if I could bend all my paintings, that'd be neat. Oh my gosh, I have so many ideas coming to me right now. These will look great. I can use photo, I can use paper, teal, purple, red, blue, almost any color imaginable. Gosh, order painting on Etsy and you make it a homemade card. <laughs> This is fun. You're probably like, all right, Anya, now you're just like playing. And I am. Wow, that's neat. I like this. Thanks, Joyce. Ugh. Paint dripping down me. This is pretty cool. I like it. I hope it, it's going to dry stuck to this though. Yeah, the back of me, of it's a mess. Hmm, I'm gonna have to figure out a way for it to dry. Nope, that won't work. All right, well, I will figure out something. But thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you next time. Bye. Hi, guys. Part two on the Yupo. So this is how it turned out. It's so cool. It's like... I love it. It's it's almost feels like like a sheet of rubber kind of and so I just quickly made up this little note card. Um I just quickly cut it out. It's you can see it's not even the glue's not dry. But I just wanted to show you what I've done with it. 
So this is just one idea. Um, I've got lots brewing in my brain right now. Um, and while I have you on here, I want to show you these. Check. Oh, focus. Oh, you're seeing my, my lights. Check out that glitter. That is, um, man, spin you around, spin you around this. And isn't that amazing? Why do I keep losing you? There we go. Oh, it just keeps going to autofocus. But it's so cool. I am in love with this. So sparkly. I'll show you my other ones. Those are pretty cool. Those just came out from being resined. And then I just resined this one and I will show you what I did. Um, there is, you can see it right there. The resin I thought was dry enough and it wasn't and I sat it on its face and it stuck. So out of this whole beautiful thing, one stupid flaw. So now I gotta fix that. Um, but anyways, so that's the Yupo. That's the gorgeous shimmer. Um, I'm trying to think real fast if I have anything else urgent to show you. Oh, I'll show you. This is um, uh, this, which was the slice and swipe that wasn't, but isn't this super cool? Look at that. I love it. So anywho, I will catch you next time. Bye.